Hey everybody, Joey Boy here, the Joy you can trust, back with another Walk Dead Road Survive video. Featuring 21 Aquamarine Necklace Crate Openings. Now as you can see here, this is what could possibly be in these crates. We have our eye on the final prize of 5k, which, if do I honestly think I'm gonna get it? In reality, maybe once, if anything, or none at all. So, really I'm looking at the... the Realistically, I think I'm gonna probably get the thousand or a bunch of hundreds and two hundreds, one to three hundreds. It'll probably be very common. But other than that, let's start crack a these babies open. Okay, so now let's start opening these necklaces. Here's the first round. So one thing to keep in mind is I will be keeping track of the aquamarine necklaces obtained throughout this video. In each corner of the video or somewhere in the video where it's not crowding, what's happening? <laughs> Next up, second one is, first one was two 300s, this one will be 200 and 200. Still on the lower end of the spectrum, it's just not really what I'm looking for right now. So, off to the third set, which I don't know why they did this, I just wish that they kept giving me crates like what you'll see here in the end and I just kind of crack everything open at once, but the monotony here kind of sucks, but whatever. 100, 200, so another really low balling roll. Not really anything that's gonna make anybody too happy. But this one was a little interesting where we got two crates in one day. I guess they must have been a hot commodity recently or that day of, or maybe an accident. Who knows? Maybe somebody hit enter twice. Double clicked instead of single clicking. I don't know, but not the greatest. Uh, 200, 100, expected. Then I think this is the last one I did such as this, and then we go to whatever's in my inventory and we just start pulling. Uh, there was, after a while, I mean, I just started to feel like th these weren't worth it. I figured uh, since combat mods were coming and so on and so forth, I was just gonna start saving my coins for that instead of kind of dropping everything on the necklaces. Yep, okay, so here we go. Here's the, here's where everything is just in, in the inventory. I think there's 12 crates. Let's start off with 100. 200, yet again, really, really crappy. Just adding diarrhea to the pile. Yep, corn, put it in. Oh, jeez. The pain. The pain! Oh! There it is, yep, there's the thousand. So we got ourselves a thousand, two more left. So, there you have it. Highest here that we got was 1,000. So I sort of wish the crates didn't have such really low lows, like these 100, 200 necklaces. Uh, honestly, I don't see myself really doing these box openings anymore, um, unless they have something really good in there, but their lowest lows are just too low for me, but they do a good job with the high highs, with the 5,000 to really make me want to pull. But I mean, just after seeing so many 100s and 200s, I just don't know if I want to do these kind of gambles anymore. I mean, just think about it, if they just were to remove the 1 in 200 aquamarine necklaces compared to everything that I got, I would just would have been up 900 more necklaces, you know, um, by a minimum. Who knows if all the other stuff would have gotten rolled higher, you know, so, but on a minimum, 900 extra necklaces. Uh, not that really big of a deal, so I'm going to probably stray away from these things right here and maybe stick more to combat mods and premier pulls. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, made you laugh before, do you think positive, please leave a nice card right here. Chop to that like, subscribe button, make sure to leave a comment down below. It supports great. Appreciate it. And other than that, I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye-bye.